Hi everyone, hope you're doing well. It's been a super hectic week for us because Callum was involved in a car accident. You probably already know this if you follow me on Instagram. He's 100% fine, but the car is a total loss. Well, I think it is because they said the value of repairs is 8,600, which is more than the car. But the insurance company have turned around and told me not to buy another car because sometimes the insurance companies repair them when they cost more to repair than the value of the car. So I don't know. So at the moment we're in a rental car, we're in a Vauxhall Astra. We're outside TK Maxx and Ice and Food Warehouse and Home Bargains. I don't know how many stores we're gonna be able to go in today um, because it's a Sunday and the stores shut early, but I need to get a few bits for holiday, which you will also know about if you follow me on Instagram, which is next week. So we're gonna pop into TK Maxx right now, see what they have. And yeah, you're coming with us as always. Just walked in and they have this fabulous coat by Guess. Just trying to see how much it is because Guess is a designer brand. Well, that must have been the retail, 149 euros. And here it is. Oh, so how much is it? 49.99. 49.99. I think you should try it on, Callum. Yeah, I'll try it on. <laughs> I, yeah, did, I didn't mean that, but just go for it. Yeah. We're right near the entrance, so anybody walking in is going to think, what the heck? This, this is a lady's coat, isn't it? Because, it's, oh, I can't even get my arms. <laughs> All right, let's fall on this. It's all good. Callum's just found this coat and I thought it would make a perfect JD cosplay from Heather's if you know Heather's the musical because I am obsessed with it and it's only $14.99 but you just try to put it on and it don't fit but do you know why it doesn't fit Callum? It helps if you look at the tag beforehand because that's an extra small that's like a size 6 Well I'm clearly not size 6 Clearly? Come on, let's shop Callum just said, I think you'll look really nice in this. Callum, didn't you say in Poundland the other week that that colour is disgusting and it looks like mustard? No, the pattern was. This is broken up by the, you know, the five horizontal stripes. And you, and you hate turtlenecks. I think you'd look nice in that. Really? I pick up better clothes than you, than you do yourself. But what size is it to start off with? Because I might go and try it just to see. Large. And the price, because that's important too. All right, if we have time, I will try it on. Yeah. Go on then, put it in the basket. Oh, I see this. But there's no way in hell I am buying that. I know you're not buying it. Sure. Look at this, this is just trash. But it would be perfect for our holiday. Because it's such well, that's an... a super thin and stretch. How much is it? Because I don't know where the tag is, because that tag's there, but... There isn't one. There isn't one. Oh. That means it's free. All right, put it in the basket and I'll try it on, okay? I think this colour is a lot better than the one what Callum picked out. What do you think? I don't think it's great, but I think it's better. Reminds me of Harry Potter Slytherin, doesn't it? Yeah, Slytherin. Comment below, what house are you? Just found this jumper and I adore it. Look, it's a hedgehog and it's got like spikes. How much is this one? $24.99 and then they've got this really nice reindeer one. Oh, they've got a Christmas llama and what's behind it? Oh, it's just more llamas and one with like hearts on. I really like that and it's in my size. I don't like the end of the sleeves though because it's got like this red band on it. Oh, I love it. I don't know if those will come off in the wash though. Wow, Anastasia Beverly Hills. This is a blush trio for $14.99. Oh, have you got one open? Can you just pop it open so we can have a look? So this is what the one boxed is, because this is obviously the tester model. Pop these in. And Liquid yeah. Liquid glow highlighters. Liquid glow highlighter. This one's already been opened. For $12.99. That's the thing with like TK Maxx though, people open them. That probably isn't a tester, it's probably just one what someone's opened and put their fingers in. Yeah. Well this one must be fancy because it's got a security tag on it and it's, oh, it's Gucci, Cal, that is Gucci. I didn't even know Gucci did makeup. For nine quid, what? what? Well it's an Gucci Eye Impact Longwear Eye Pencil with a sharpener for £9. It's quite funny that that's in a security case and the other ones are more expensive than they're not. 
That's because Gucci, isn't it? You could, you could get that, and then when people say, what are you wearing, you can go Gucci, wear Gucci wearing it? Gucci. They don't need to know it's your makeup. You guys know I love my face masks, and Callum has just picked up this ginseng one, which I believe is Korean, and it's $1.99, and it's a black sheet mask. I wonder what, like, ginseng is going to be to help... Energise and revitalise. Yeah, and, and some other things, but like there's some young... Energise. Yeah, to energise, but there's some young viewers, but I might give this a try. Probably not before I go on holiday. <gasps> Look, snail mask. And that's got ginseng in it too. It's not red ginseng. Red gin... Well, what's the difference between like red ginseng and... Well, that one at orange, <laughs> that one at red. You know what, like snail, like slime, is really good for your skin. You know when I was younger, there was a massive craze on it. Around the same time as the Atkins diet was going big, everyone started buying snail slime for wrinkles. Another one. It's a poor one. Oh, what's this one? Blackout pore masks. Yeah. Oh, this is good. It actually removes the blackheads, look. Yeah. How much is this? I need this. $2.99. Oh, I'm going to be in this section for a while. There's another one in. I mean, it's charcoal. They have loads of eyelashes in here, especially by Eyelaw for only $1.99. And this stood out because it says the Vlogger series, and it's Anne Lee, and the lashes are really, really nice. The retail was $8.99, and Callum's just looked her up. And I thought she would have been like a beauty vlogger, but it looks like she's like a DIY in home. Is it her or not? She's got one point. Six million followers. We were trying to like. It looks roughly. Yeah, it's hard to tell when you have a sticker covering her eyes, but yeah. Callum's just found an entire set of Paris Hilton makeup brushes, and I didn't even know that Paris Hilton had makeup brushes. Got fan brush. Oh, they're really pretty. Yeah. But you know what? They look really cheaply made. They do. But they are quite cheap. Three ninety nine for I'm this sorry. one. Well, the contour and powder look identical. What's the difference? Oh, sweetheart. They look identical. <laughs> I'm looking at They are that's different. Nothing. I like Real Techniques makeup brushes, but they're all 3 dollars aren't they? Yeah. So if you do want to get yourself a Paris Hilton makeup brush, you know to come to TK Mac. Just found this Relax and Pamper Technic Toiletry Advent Calendar, and it was £16, and it's now only £7.99. Now, I think that is really reasonable, and it's really heavy. I'm guessing it's got lots of goodies inside. Oh, it's got things like bath bombs and soaps and stuff. I like that it doesn't tell you exactly what it has inso inside, but it gives you like a little idea, but it is very heavy. So if you want to get yourself a advent <laughs> calendar, you might want to come here. I like wearing sunglasses for driving, and Callum wore them for a few weeks, and they have disappeared. You shouldn't even be wearing my sunglasses. So I now have to buy a new pair, so I'm in the clearance section. And I'm trying to find one near the style because it was like a cat eye. So, so far I've found these two, but they're nowhere near the quality of the juicy ones I got last year. So, oh, look at these. Look at those ones. They are, they are, wow, they are sun. They are so you've got to put them on. That is horrendous. I'm sorry. When you watch that back, you'll realise how bad they are. I don't even know. But like, what about these? Oh, they're not even... Right, let's try it. Let's try them ones, because that's just, just as ridiculous. Okay. <laughs> Very yellow, that would remind me of a minion. They don't actually look that bad. Do you think I look fabulous? You always look fabulous. Nah. Callum found these ones, and they're by Guess. But they're £24, but they are in the clearance. These ones are by Polarised. Or polarized. Mm, don't like those ones. I do. And right, these ones. I don't know if they're just a bit too cat eye. -y. Um. So it's. No, uh, they actually really look really good. If I could just lay these up here for a second. Or sure. Where can I lay them? There until I put them back. Oh, I right. do like those ones though. So I think I'm going to go with these glasses. I'm not 100% like sold on them, but 
They're in the clearance, they're by Guess, so I'm kind of fancy. Do oh, you know what? I'm buying all the fancy stuff. I'm buying Guess and Gucci today. Yeah. And I don't even know what the make of those clothes are, but we better get trying them on because... We don't have a lot of time. We don't have a lot of time because the shop's going to shut soon. So let's get to the changing rooms. Right, let's go. This is the dress what Callum picked. You'll definitely have to wear like Spanx with it. And before anyone asks, no, I'm not pregnant. I'm just podgy. <laughs> But yeah, can you see that? Even at some parts, like you can see cellulite. I never ever wear like anything like a dress because my legs are really scarred up. But for the holiday, I'm, I might put some shorts on and go out of my comfort zone, but this is a no-no. I mean, if this was a top, I'd love it as a top. Cal, if you could make it into like a jumper, I'd love it as a jumper. Yeah. How much is it? Twelve ninety nine. My mum could change it into a jumper, but look at that! Look at that! This is a leopard print style top I picked out. I don't know. Part of me really loves it, but then part of it thinks it's going to clash with what I want to put it with. I do like it though. How? Actually, really. Nice. Really nice. Thank you. I will give that one to you. That looks really nice. I'm not too keen on the length of the tassels, but that's a really nice fit. Really nice cut. Yeah. See. This is a denim jacket, which I really love. But I obviously wouldn't wear it with this coloured denim. I don't know. I'm not a fashionista. Does this clash? To me, it does. I'll ask Callum because Callum always give me clothing advice but it feels really nice and comfortable and a nice thing to just like sling on if it gets like breezy on holiday. Cal? Yup. Oh, not with that jacket now. I, I don't think it goes with no. that. Double down, you cannot double down. I know, but it, it, it's it, nice. Oh, what's her face? It was full denim for it. Oh, Emma Blackery? Yeah. Alright, so I'm going to go back in here because if not, they're going to be nice. one. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. It's nice, but not with what I've got on. So, right, it's going to be the price what determines it. How much is it? $14.99. Not too bad. So, yeah, definitely get rid of the thing. Yeah, if you take the mustardy one, and we keep the other two. Thank you. Um, still no... That looks really nice on you. It's just the fit one. I knew it weren't going to suit me, but this one's got no price. Has it? So we're going to have to find out how much that one is. Okay. You're in 10 minutes. Really? That's quite quick. Um, That's alright because they've got seats there, I was fine. That's quite Instagram. quick actually, considering like what I've got on is quite tight. Now I want to look for some trainers which will be really comfortable to walk in. Huh? Look, I thought they'd be good and then my size. Tinkerbell dress. That is nothing like Tinkerbell. That's you awful. Make... You look like a walking tree. These are Gucci, no, they're Guess. Ah. I was going to say. So they make a full Gucci outfit, yeah? Or oh, look, they've got seven and a half in them. That's your size, isn't it? Look, these are nice. Look, these are a seven. I, I need white trainers that are really comfortable to walk in. These are 29.99. I don't know what they're down from, but they're Guess, so I'm guessing a lot. You'll probably see, but guys, just want to point out, I have my socks inside out because I've got autism and they really irritate me. Um, it's just one of the things I have to do. If not, I can't like wear socks. Because I know someone will comment going, your socks are inside out. <laughs> They're always inside out. Do you do yours inside out or not? Do I'm not, not weird. <laughs> no. I'm not weird either. Right. <laughs> See, I must say these are really comfy. That's like you walking in the morning, Holly. <laughs> really in the morning? Yeah, when you're outside, you walk. Oh, they look good. I think they do. Everybody else on here will probably think, no, they look really bad. Well, I think they look really shiny and cool. Well, let, me, let me get a full shot of you, because I couldn't get one earlier. I don't know if they'll go with what I've got to wear. Will it go with that leopard print? I don't know. I found a pair of Converse. These are actually in size six, and they're too big. It's so weird. Well, it's not too big. They're just slipping at the back. I they will know. loosen up as well because of the material they are. I don't are. know if that's just what Converse do. No, they, they, will, they will loosen up but, as well. But they go better than the other ones, but the other ones just look like fabulous. 
do you know what? This is how, this is how you do design on a budget. Because mm. I'm gonna have like guest trainers, guest sunglasses, Gucci makeup. Yeah. Step aside, all you rich people. It's cheap. Learn how to shop. Can I just find these shoes? Because we're looking for a pair of shoes for Bella, and it says B M S, and that's her initials, Bella Marie Smith. Got a little fox on it as well. Oh, and they're good price as well. God, I think she's about a. See, we wanted to bring her today. But he's she, a nine. She had to go to another now. event. We're now upstairs. Look at the dress-up costumes. They are so adorable. Oh, and the clearance. I'm guessing because Halloween has just passed. Yeah, look, they've got like the witches ones and stuff. Oh, look at this little knight. <gasps> Six pound. Could you hold that a second? Sure. It says it's a spooky one, but it doesn't look spooky. Because you know, like, my friend is Well, they're just obsessed. advertising it as spooky, aren't they? Oh, just Halloween, like six to nine months. If we could get that in a bigger size, that is just the perfect present for my friend. For hmm. my friend's, like, child, because they're obsessed with... Oh, there's one here. Oh, they're all six to nine. But if you want to dress a, a six to nine month old up as a knight, you know where to come. These are only six pounds. That is incredible. That is really good. And can I just mention... I'm not sponsored by any of the stores I go in. I would love to be, but one way you will know 100% that I'm not lying is because I put multiple stores in vlogs. So when you see me go to Home Bargains, Poundland and B&M, if I was sponsored by them, I wouldn't be allowed to do that. I'd just have to film in their store for the whole year. So that's how you know. They're very strict. They're already playing Christmas songs. Yeah. Can you hear that? I know, I had it in the changing rooms. I said, you're going to love that. Oh, I was busy on Instagram. <laughs> you post more on Instagram than I do. I do. I love it. <laughs> Follow us both. Here are our Instagram handles. Cal, you know the car is like a total write-off. Yeah. I really want to buy a Lamborghini. I know we're not funny. That's a joke I would come up with. And even I thought that was bad. 9.99. I found a flamingo doorstop and they've got loads of other ones. I've got this unicorn too and this unicorn which is fabulous. That looks more like a dog or a pig doesn't it? That must be a unicorn though because it's got a horn. Oh, How yeah. much is this one? This one, seven pound. Hmm. So if you want <gasps> they got a pineapple doorstop, at the back. Yeah, pineapple. Oh, so if you like pineapples you get a pineapple doorstop too. Oh, wow, and a mermaid. Wow. And a Christmas pud. If you like Peter Rabbit, we've found this tea set and it's 9 99 And obviously you can reuse these containers. You've got English afternoon tea, English breakfast tea and Earl Grey for the sophisticated tea drinkers like yourself, Callum. Yeah. But Holly, what, what is it? It's a Peter Rabbit. <laughs> Harry would be proud I of you. Why, I wondered why you were smirking behind the camera. <laughs> I was trying to like... Stop going, why are you laughing at me? <laughs> it was Peter Rabbit. Rabbit. Peter Rabbit. So you know I'm not the most festive of people. How about these? We've got a Rudolph shirt. Pretty good. We've got a Christmas pudding shirt. I look pretty tasty in this. <laughs> really? <laughs> no, you got a Santa hat one. And they're £12.99 each. They are amazing. Which oh, one? Which one do you think we should buy for Callum and we will come back and we will buy it? I'm feeling that one the most actually. Right, what do you think below? Is it going to be a Santa, a Rudolph or a Christmas pudding? You decide. Look at these for gifts. They're uh, champagne mixers in a large glass and they also have margaritas. How much are these? Got to be very careful. $12.99. I think mean, that's a lovely little gift for someone for Christmas. If you know someone who likes their alcohol, you sorted. I think this doll looks adorable. It looks like Moana as a baby, and it's twenty nine ninety nine. Callum's holding the lift for me, so. I, 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 I just saw you walk before you can come back. I, like, I know. Where's she going? All right, let's go. So we've got our clothes here. I got Molly this um, dress, which oh no, it's stuck. Where is it? This one. I think it's gorgeous. I love it. I liked another one and I picked it up and I said, right, I'm having the other one. Then I had a look and it was actually age nine, but it was put in the like Six. age like yeah. seven to eight. Yeah. Um, we've got Bella a pair of shoes. We don't know if they're going to fit, so definitely keep the receipt. Because um, obviously it's not for here. Mm, 
just off to time. Thank you for watching our vlog today. If you liked it, please hit that subscribe button because we make videos like this all the time. And until next time, we will see you soon. Bye.